You know, I want to make this video right here because I want the people out there to be able to distinguish between those who are genuine and those who are disingenuous. Did you hear what I said? Those who are genuine and those who are disingenuous. There's a big difference. A lot of people out here in this world today, you know, they talk about a lot of stuff, but they understand very little. Today, people are having a hard time defining words and the definitions of those words. They're literally having a hard time trying to define what they are. People today, okay, so one of the big things is adultery. I know that a lot of you out there are steeped in false doctrine and, and false teachings and stuff, and Ringo TV is the same one. Uh, no matter what, he continues. He says he's not about no negativity. He's not about all this and that. And he, like many others, they just simply are driven with demonic spirits. They simply just cannot stop. They can't cease from sin. They have eyes that are full of adultery. They cannot cease from sin. And our whole purpose of existence is to beguile unstable souls. So the only way so that everybody out here can really truly get a good temperature for what's going on, is Ringo, I'm going to do this again for about the fourth time. We can set up a time and we can go on live on my platform. I'll bring you in and you can, we'll, we'll see what you know. You can define what you believe to be. You answer my questions. I'll answer your questions. What's wrong with that? What is wrong with that? I can't, how much more honest can you be? And many of you already know that I'm doing. See, what I'm trying to do out here is I'm trying to show you that a lot of these people have nefarious ways about them. They're not concerned about truth. They're not concerned about honor. They're not concerned about integrity. These are content creators. They're concerned about drama. And whenever their, their numbers start to fall, then they have to come and mention my name in, in some type of negative light. To them, it makes no difference. It's, it's what, in their eyes, it's all been false. They're never going to say nothing that's positively truth about me. They used to at one time. But when they, hey, you have to understand, once you have put yourself out there and you have engaged in believing ac false accusations and you become a slanderer and a liar, you're engaged. You're, you're committed now. And saving face. And keeping that pride means more to them than actually having an intelligent, healthy dialogue. So y'all go tell Ringo I said that. Say, tonight, I will be on Hold Fast Wednesdays. We'll, we'll bring you on in. I'll bring you on in. I'll take all the other pastors out of the panel. As soon as you decide, if you decide to come in and, and stop ducking and dodging and stop throwing rocks and hiding hands, as soon as you say you want to come into the show, I'll take out Pastor Muir and Pastor Corey. It'll just be you and I. And, and, and Brother Israel, the well, only thing he would do is just moderate uh, on the video editing thing or the video thing, because I don't know how to do all that. Let's see how much of a so-called man of truth you are. Because I got questions. You got questions, I got questions. Now we get an opportunity for the, the, the court of public opinion gets an opportunity to be able to see what is really going on? They get to see truth from error, right from wrong. They get to see the right spirit from wrong spirit. And of course, you know, my main concern is all these, these unstable souls. These unstable souls out there that they don't know what to believe. And the only way you can do it is the same way that Yahshua did with the scribes and Pharisees that put them out there in front of everybody openly. Openly. So Ringo, come on tonight. If not, contact me. Some way, shape, fast, or form. I don't know how to contact you. You called the dining hall one time and hung up. And and private number and everything. And I and, and just said a few words and that was it. Hey, I listen. Come on, Ringo. Let's see how much of a man of truth you are. Let's get it. Let's do this.